The Dalton Whitfield Solid Waste Authority is encouraging students to create artwork for billboards to promote recycling. Leah Bowling visited the winning school and has the story. Hundreds of students submitted their design to be on this billboard and the lucky winner was from Eastbrook Middle School. This was one of the years that we had so many, it was hard to choose. And even some of the ones that I loved didn't even get a top three just because there were so many great entries. Corey Orr, a science teacher at Eastbrook Middle School, says her students were really passionate about the contest. They were excited about it. They were some really good. I was glad I was not the judge. Looking at their artwork, I was like, man, this is going to be tough. The competition was fierce, but both first and second place overall designs came from eighth graders at Eastbrook Middle School. It just called me to the front office and I got the news and I was like, wow, and I was very shocked. Heartline says recycling rates in Whitfield County tend to be between five and eight percent. That's how much we're, throw we're putting in the recycling versus throwing away. Our aim is to get to like the, the national average is 30%. So that's our aim. That's where we'd like to get at least is to get to the average, if not, you know, beyond that. The importance of recycling is being passed on to future generations. The world is a beautiful place and the way we're destroying it with our waste is awful. I just think it's important that everyone knows what we're doing to the world and what big of a difference we could make by recycling one piece of waste. Or says she's proud of her students for tackling this project. I saw it on the billboard passing by one day and I took a picture of it, like I stopped the car, went out and got a picture of it, looked like a crazy person, you know, taking a picture of a billboard. But for the kids, I think it's important to see their stuff out there, that you're making a difference. I think when people see artistic projects and they really look into it and see the true meaning behind it, it can change someone's perspective about something. Reporting in Dalton, I'm Leah Bowling, Local 3 News. Leah, and congratulations to the first place winner, Yoselin Rodriguez. She says she loves drawing and wants to be an artist when she grows up, but we say she already is. Mm -hmm.